Quilters, it's Sam from AccuQuilt. Let me give you a couple of really great tips on how to get the most use out of your English paper piecing dies. So this die is divided into two sections. This side is meant to cut the fabric for your hexagons, and this side is meant to cut the cardstock centers for your hexagons. Quilters, this is the only die where every day the mailman brings you quilting supplies. If you're wondering what kind of paper to use here, get these great junk mailers that you get in the mail. I just use one layer at a time, and let me show you how to lay your fabric down. You wanna make sure you have that lengthwise green so it's nice and tight. I'm gonna put on my cutting mat, run it through my cutter, All right, give it a little love, get rid of that static slide, that mat, don't lift. Now look at this. I've cut my hexagons, but look at this. I've also cut the paper centers, okay? So this is how they go in the middle, and then you would use your glue stick to baste around it, and then whip stitch your pieces together. But a quilter taught me a great tip because eventually you're gonna to have to take those papers out. All you have to do is take a hole punch. Punch a hole in the center of your paper pieces, just like this. And now when you're done, you can just stick your needle in there and flip out the paper. At AccuQuilt, we help you cut time so you can quilt more.